Om Shanti and we are here with the 6th of June's Godly Blessing where Supreme Father wants us to make everything lighter through our thoughts, words and actions so that everything feels light to not just us but to everybody around us too. So let's see what does Baba have to say. Godfather says, May you be as loving and detached as the Father. So you're loving also towards everybody but at the same time detached. That means you're not expecting anything in return for the kindness, for the for the humility, for the love, for the patience, for the tolerance which you are showing towards others. You don't expect anything in return for them. You don't expect them to follow you, to, to accept everything which you say, to be somebody who is always saying yes to everything which you say. So God says, may you be as loving and detached as the Father and make every task light with your stage of lightness. To experience your three subtle powers of mind, intellect and sanskars, to be light is to be as detached and loving as the Father. So if you want to feel the powers of the mind, the intellect and the sanskars, we have to become lighter. That means if you are somebody who expects something from others for the things which you have done, then there is not going to be any lightness in the mind. There are going to be too many questions. Why? Why not? Who? Where? What? And these questions don't put a full stop or a dot in a mind. There's a train of thoughts and these thoughts lead us to become heavier in a mind. And we make other people also heavier with these same questions. So God says, according to the time, the external atmosphere is tamopradhan. Tamopradhan means everybody is in confusion. Everybody has got impure, negative thoughts. So the atmosphere of vibration of thoughts, just like we've got vibration, or let's say frequency of uh, signals coming from the different towers, could be any, any phone tower, mobile tower. Similarly over here, every soul is like that tower, radiating frequencies of thoughts. And that is Tamopratan, that is impure. And the attitudes of human souls are heavy. So the, there's no tolerance, there's no acceptance. Everybody wants their way, everybody wants everybody to understand and accept their way. So there's ego too, so there's a lot of heaviness. To the extent that the external atmosphere is heavy, accordingly your thoughts, actions and relationships have to continue to be light. So people in the world are getting heavier in their thoughts, words and actions. And God says, since you are connected to me, since you are meditating on me, your thoughts, words and actions need to become lighter. And because of this lightness, all your tasks will continue to be light. You will not be influenced by any business of the world which we are living in. That means their tasks, their methods of dealing with things and people is not going to affect us. The negativity, the impurity the vibrations of intolerance or ego are not going to affect us. This is the stage of being equal to the Father. Just like the Supreme Creator, the Father is loving also towards us, gives us this knowledge so as to make us strong and powerful and then is detached. Whether we children follow it, don't follow it, that's our own destiny, not His destiny. So God gives us this knowledge, this blessing and whether we want to follow it or not follow it is our decision and that's why He's loving also but at the same time He's detached. So just like this physical, uh, non-physical father, the physical parents too can adopt the same nature. Be loving, guide the children, but if they don't listen, be detached. Because every soul has got their own destiny. How do you do that? How do you reach this level of understanding of wisdom is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris through practice and meditation. You too can learn it with this Om Shanti.